Hey everyone, welcome to my video channel today. Unlike anything we had before, some people ask me how to create prismatic column inside the CSI bridge. Well, literally, I decided to model these kinds of column inside the CSI bridge. By the way, if you are here for first time, please watch the parametric variation tutorial that helps you figure out what will be happening here all right let's get started select the component section properties frame sections add new property select the concrete and hit the rectangular uh, well in this tutorial we need to define three kinds of column so First column we call the top section. The deck is eight meter. In this tutorial, the deck width was about ten meter. If you wouldn't consider the cantilever section, this value about eight meter. So the width is one point five, and hit OK. So another section we called what section? The diff is for example four meter. The width is as same as top section. Hit OK. So another job we need to do is define the prismatic column because we want to connect the top to bottom section we select the other non-prismatic column we called here the start section we select the bottom section the end section we select the bottom and the length is for example 2.6 the length type is select absolute the stiffness in both direction we select the parabolic it's add the another section we need to define in this panel we have to connect the top bottom to top section so the end section we select the top section the length is for example 4.a the length type is absolute and the stiffness as same as the previous one so hit add and hit ok another job we need to do is define the capping hit the add new property select the concrete rectangular and we called capping the diff is 0.05, the width is 1.5, it's okay. The another job we need to do is define the bends. So select the component and bends, hit the add new bridge bends, we call bends. For example, cap beam, we select the cap beam, the length of cap beam, we insert 8 meter, the number of column is 1, so hit the modify column data, the section of column, we select the pier, The distance we insert 4 meter, the high is 8 meter and hit OK. The another job we need to do is modify the current bridge object, select the bridge, bridge object, hit the modify. As you see in this picture, the bent parameter introduced as a blue line. So hit select the bends and hit the modify show. In this panel, the first pen, we 
assign the bend tree and second bend we assign the bend tree hit ok and ok the last job we need to do is update the model select the bridge update the bridge object and hit ok all right that's great thanks for watching if you enjoy it just make sure to give us a like and subscribe to our channel i see you next tutorial